and McGee's in position to follow her. And now he's got caught a little bit. Now, this is going to be very significant and a vindication, exactly as we enter the final lap, of McGee's tactics of making sure she covers everything that Laura Muir does. So now he, a real danger for a medal here. Looks like she's got a lot of ground to make up because with every stride, Laura Muir has been tracked by Kieran McGeehan. And we've rarely seen this at European level. Five gold medals for Laura Muir at European level. She's never been challenged like this before. And it's Laura Muir with 200 metres to go. And Kira McGeehan is in the silver medal position. And surely she's got a medal sewn up here because the gap back to the pack is 20, 30 metres. Just keep it going. Kira McGeehan, literally, at this moment, the gold medal is a possibility. But Laura Muir has got strength and she's got speed. That 156, 800 metre speed is going to take her by the looks of it to the gold medal. Now Kira's got to make sure that she keeps the momentum going. No lactic acid at this point, Kira McGeehan. All the way to the line. She's going to get a silver medal. A brilliant, brilliant silver medal for Kira McGeehan. Muir takes gold and a wonderful silver for Kira McGeehan, just as she did in the Commonwealth Games. And she's beaten Sophia Nowy, which was really the big opponent that she had in this race because Anawi got her in Berlin four years ago and she's got revenge and Muir is out in her feet Kira is smiling from ear to ear a thoroughly deserved silver medal a clap on the back <laughs> and this is wonderful they did this exact thing in the Commonwealth Games lying on the ground they acknowledge each other's efforts both of them spent completely and 